hanging out over here at this place called Off the Grid out in uh, Old Sac by the river. It's a good conversation, man. Talking about life, you know, the conscious life. Not just the zombie life, you know. I get sick of going through life like a zombie. I see other people, you know, I'm not impacting their life. I just sit around and walk past people. They're looking like zombies and I know it. I'm just being another one of the zombies in this world. Walking around, not being conscious, not being aware of other people, you know? I don't know, I have a gift where I could like walk past people and I feel their life. I feel what they've been through. I can feel it literally inside my spirit. I walk past some people and I can feel the shame they have. Or other people I walk past and I can feel the confidence they have. I can feel they're doing something with their life. I want to say something. But what constantly stops me is what if they think I'm just some, not crack, I'm just some kid trying to be cool. You no, know, I'm tired of feeling that way. I'm tired of the fear that hinders me from really impacting someone's life. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just here with my friend Nate, and he's been encouraging me just to let loose and be free and let me, li and just really be myself. You know, yeah, yeah, don't dog. let others oppress me don't let others stop me from being who I am so Nate if you have um, some words to share yeah <laughs> so you know so many times like we we're afraid to fail <laughs> um, but we end up creating the very thing we're afraid of like like listen like you're a creator whoever's watching this you are a creator if you don't believe me go draw some even if it's a stick figure you just created a stick figure so, like, you have the ability to create whatever you want, and whether you realize it or not, you're actually, uh, you actually have an electrical pulse to you, and that, that electrical pulse sends off energy, whether you know it or not. So you're either subconsciously and unconsciously creating, or you're going to be conscious and aware and create out of a state of being awake or asleep. So what does one do who's awake? They realize that failure doesn't actually exist. And they realize <laughs> that, well, that like, listen, man, you got to get past this fear of failing. What does it even mean to fail? It's just an opportunity to learn. It's just an opportunity to grow. Whenever you mess up, dude, it's just an opportunity to get right back up and keep walking, to get right back up and keep moving. And so, you know, here's the thing. If, you, if you're operating out of a place of fear, that's what you're creating in your life. Like, I remember, I'm going to share this story with you guys. I remember one time, I, I was driving my mother-in-law's car, okay, and I said, wouldn't it be crazy if I just wrecked her car? And then I drove around the rest of the day being afraid that I would actually total her car, and I ended up totaling her car. <laughs> and uh, I created... A reality that I didn't want now there's plenty of times when I've created a reality that I have wanted um, you know and look I'm just an average dude like I'm just not average like we're not all average like we got dude we, we're all amazing people but I'm just telling you I'm just another dude who like has you know struggles I've, I've dealt with the fear of failure but you got to understand that like as long as you keep creating from a place of unconscious fear You'll never be able to move past it into a place of conscious love and create from that place of conscious love, which is what you are. Like, you're, you're full of love. You're full of light. 